here is the two breast pumps. I am excited about this. I hope it worked real good. Hey y'all, welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I am going to be talking about my breastfeeding journey. Um, so in a previous video, I talked to you guys and I told y'all that baby boy was born early. He was born at 35 weeks. And so I, when he came, it was something that I was not used to. My kids normally come at between 39 weeks and 41 weeks. And so I wasn't used to having a preemie and I was having doubts that my milk was in, my milk was in, like my colostrum. So um, I had started pumping to see if it was in and I was just giving it, giving him the colostrum and then the milk through uh, a bottle. And so he was getting that. <clears throat> and when he first was born, he did latch on. He latched on really good. And um, he sucked and stuff like that, but I just wasn't sure that he was getting anything. So then that's why I started giving him the bottle. And so after after a baby gets a bottle and it's easy for them to get it, um, they kind of no longer want the breast because it's harder. They have to suck longer um, for you to have a letdown and then the milk come down. So we've still been working on that. Um, but he is primarily, well, really right now he's only bottle fed. Uh, he gets my breast milk through a bottle. And so I pump it, of course, um, give it to him, which I wanted him to be on the bottle because I wanted to be able to be freed up. Sometimes I wanted his dad to be able to feed him and also his sisters to be able to feed him too. Um, that would free me up. That would allow him and his dad to get bonding time and then him and his sisters to get bonding time. So it has been really good, but I also want him um, to be breastfed as well because it's easier for me when I can just put him on the boob sometime and he drink from there. And especially during the middle of the night, um, it's easier for me to just put him on my breast and let him drink. Uh, and I'm talking about from previous experience with my previous kids. Um, it's easier to just wake up in the middle of the night put them on the breast and um, let them suck whether that, rather than going and getting a bottle, warm it up um, and stuff like that. So we're still working on him latching uh, with my first son. Um, it kind of was the same situation uh, where he went to the NICU when he was first born. We gave him bottle and then he didn't want to drink from the breast. But after like a month of st of continuously trying to get him back on the breast, he did get back on the breast. So I'm very hopeful that I can get him um, back on the breast to do both, do breast and bottle. Um, so I'll up keep you guys updated on that. But for right now, I am pumping. And I, and I was thinking because I've had like, I, I had the same pump. Um, I think since my son, it was either since my first son, which was seven years ago, because he would have been seven right now, or my daughter, my first daughter, which she's five, she's five right now. So I've had that pump for a really long time. It was my favorite pump. It was the Free Me pump. Now Free Me has an updated version, which I had ordered my third child and I didn't like the updated version. So I just stuck with the first version. It was my favorite pump, but like a week after he was born, the pump went out. Like it, the suction just was not sucking good. I was so devastated. I was like full, needed to pump. And I was like, oh my God, what am I going to do? So I was going to send my husband to the store. Well, I did send my husband to the store to get like a, um, a hand pump. But one of my friends, um, she had ended up, I had texted her and she ended up, she having, she had a, a like a, a, a different pump um, than I had. It was called, it's called the Spectra. I'll show you guys. Um, it's called the Spectra. And um, she, she sent that one to me. And it's not a hands-free one, which I really need. Okay, hold on, baby. Um, it's not a hands-free one which I was like, oh, I need a hands-free one because, you know, they have, they come up with updated pumps all the time. Um, but I I got that one from her 
and I've been using that one, but I just ordered, well, no, I ordered my hands-free one like two weeks ago and it just came in. So I'm going to be, so in this video, I'm going to be showing y'all um, the pump that I'm using now. And then I'll show y'all how much milk I get from it. And then later I'm going to unbox, I'm going to unbox the new hands-free pump that I'm so excited about. Um, I'm going to unbox that one and then show y'all how much milk I get from that one. And hopefully I like it because I've really, really, really been wanting a hands-free pump and really need a hands-free pump so that I'm not, um, so that pump that I ordered, it's, I'm going to show you guys, but it's hands-free and it's wireless. Like you don't have to be hooked up to the wall, which I'm so excited about because I need to be able to put a pump in, put, put a pump in my bra pump milk and still be able to like take care of the kids, wash dishes, wash clothes, whatever, whatever I need to be doing. I don't need to be just sitting in one place for however long it takes me to pump. Normally it takes me like 30 minutes because I like to do 20 minutes on one side, 10 minutes on my slacker side. Everybody, every woman has a slacker side. Uh, <laughs> if you ever bought breast, breast uh, pump, you know what I'm talking about. But, um, but yeah, so I normally have to sit down for like 30 minutes and that's just not, not feasible for me. I have too many kids, too many responsibilities. So I'm going to just be showing you guys um, what we got. So yeah, let me go grab the pump that I've been using right now. Show you guys and I'll be right back. Okay, so this is the pump that I've been using. This is the one my friend let me use. And it is the Spectra pump. And it's really good. I like it. Uh, it's really good. It gets all my milk out. Um, it, uh, yeah. But it's just, it's just, I don't, it doesn't work for me because I have to sit down. It has to be plugged into the wall. The plug goes right here. And then it has to be plugged into the wall. Well, actually, it does charge. Like that, that plug can charge it. Oh, God, baby boy. <laughs> He, he wants to be picked up. Let me hear you. So, um, it has to be plugged into the wall to charge it. But then you can take it out and pump. Like, if I want to take it to the living room and um, pump in there or, you know. But it's just, I have to be, it's, this cord has to be attached. Um, I attach the piece and then um, it has to be on me and I have to sit still. I can't do what I want to do freely. Um, so, yeah. So, this is the one I've been using but I'm going to show you the one that I just purchased out of. Okay, so this is the one that I just purchased. It's the Mon Late brand. And it's a hands-free wearable breast pump. So this one, of course, is going to allow me to just be able to stick these in my bra. And it's supposed to just pump the milk while I am doing whatever it is that I need to be doing. Take care of the kids, fixing lunches, fixing dinner, cooking, cleaning, whatever. So I'm so excited about being able to try this. Uh, of course, I'm gonna show y'all how it works um, and let y'all know how much milk I get from it and if I like it. But I have to go pump right now. I need to pump, baby boy needs some milk right now. So I'm about to use the Spectra for hopefully the last time. <laughs> And then I can return that. But I'm just going to use the Spectra just for this video purposes. Um, so that I can show you guys how much milk I get from that. Okay, baby boy. Okay, okay. I'm going to show you guys how much milk I get from that one. And then later on when it's time for me to pump again, I'll use this new Mon Lake breast pump. And then show you how much I get from that one. Alright, let me go pump real quick. Okay, I got everything set up. I'm about to go ahead and pump, and I'm gonna be pumping both sides, and I'll let you know how much I get. <laughs> What's your name? Um, Naya. Naya? Yeah. I like your name. Thank you. <laughs> All right, y'all, I'm finished pumping, and this is how much I got from my right breast. And it is four ounces. And this is how much I got from my left breast, aka my slacker breast. <laughs> and this is 
uh, this is two and a half ounces. So it didn't do too bad. <laughs> so I'm about to go ahead and put this in a bottle for him. And he's only, he's only drinking two ounces right now. Um, at each feeding, he, he drinks about two ounces. So I'm just going to put, put it in bottles and put two ounces a piece in each bottle and go ahead and give him that one bottle because he is sucking the mess out of this pacifier. He is hungry. Sorry, son. I'm about to get your milk, son. He is looking me dead in my face like, mama, hurry up. You talking to YouTube and not getting my milk. I'm about to get it. I already pumped it. I'm about to put it in the bottle and put it in your mouth. Yes, sir. That's what I'm about to do. And y'all, I forgot to tell, I forgot to tell y'all, he is one month today. Did you one month? I need to take his one month picture and post him on social media. With his cute self. <laughs> this is him. Say hi, YouTube. <laughs> I don't want to talk right now. I'm hungry. <laughs> and he is definitely getting bigger. He's filling out. This is a preemie outfit he has on, but he is filling it out now. Like at first he could he could not fill out his preemie outfits. But he he we can tell. That he's of course filling out his preemie outfits, and then he's also um, he he feels heavier. He feels heavier, and what else? How else do we know he gained weight? And he's just eating more often, eating more. Is that what I mean? Yeah, he smells so good. I love to just sit here and smell him. <laughs> Is that right? Said, mommy is obsessed. Yes. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and feed him. And then um, I'm going to be back at my next feeding time. And I'm going to unbox the new Mon Late um, breast pump with you guys. And also uh, show you, show show it to you. And then show you how much I get from it. Oh, and from this, um, this pumping session, I did 20 minutes on each side. And that's how much I got with 20 minutes from each side with the Spectra breast pump. I got four ounces for my right side and two and a half ounces for my left side. So yeah, we'll be back at our next pumping time. Yeah, see you in a minute. Alright y'all, it's time for me to pump again. And this time I'm going to use my new Mon Late breast pump. And so of course, like I was telling y'all, this one is a hands-free wearable breast pump. And so I'm about to take it out of the package. And I got two of them on their website. They give you the option to buy either one or two but i did buy two and this is what it looks like let me get the other one out and then also it comes with the instruction manual the usb in order they say in order to charge it it charges in two hours via micro USB. And so it comes with two USBs. And a couple of extra parts just in case you need it. But here is the two breast pumps. I'm excited about this. I hope it worked real good. 
and it already comes charged. So this is how you turn it on. And I don't know if y'all can hear that or see that, but it is already sucking. And it has these buttons across the top. Let's see where y'all can see it. To adjust the suction. And it also has, on the side of the box, it says it has two phase modes, stimulation and expression. So yeah, so I am about to use these two pumps and then I'm going to come back and show y'all how much I get. All right, so I am finished pumping and out of my right boob, I got... I got two and a half ounces. And then out of my left, I got I got one ounce. So not as much as I got with the Spectra, but um this is my first time using it. And I did like using it. I did like it. Um I loved being able to be hands free. Um, it I went for like 20 minutes on both sides. Um, I was able to walk around and I didn't do much. <laughs> I should have, but I didn't do much. Um, only because it's late and I don't really have that much to do right now. Um, but yeah, so I liked it. And the reason why, of course, the reason why I wanted this um, hands free wireless breast pump is so that I'm able to do stuff around the house, um, get other stuff done. But if it's not gonna get all of my milk out, and maybe it did get all of my milk out, maybe I just didn't have a lot of milk right now. So I am gonna try it in the morning. And of course in the morning you have the most milk. Sorry, son son over there trying to get me to pick him up. He trying to make all the noise so I can go over and pick him up. But um Normally, in the morning time, you get the most milk. Hold on, y'all. Let me go pick him up. Okay, I'm back. Okay, so, you know, normally, in the morning time, you get the most milk because your body has rested and um, you just produce produce all your milk overnight and stuff. So, I normally get the most in the morning anyway. So, I'm going to try it again in the morning let y'all know how much I get. Um, but I have to be able to get out my milk out. I have to, I have to be able to use the best pump that's gonna, um, suction, have the best suction and get the most milk out because I know, um, I produce a lot of milk. I am naturally a overproducer and I've been that way since my first baby seven years ago. So I'll, I'll know, um, if a pump is not, um, is not getting all of my milk out. And if this pump is not going to get all of my milk out, I'm going to have to do something different. I do not want to go back to, um, having to sit in one place and pump milk. I don't want to go back to that, but I have to be able to get all of my milk out so that I'm, um, feeding him what he needs and just so that my body, I'm getting rid of all of the milk that, and my body's not thinking, oh, he's not, the baby don't need that much milk. So stop producing that much milk. <clears throat> so yeah, so I do like the pump. I'm going to try it again in the morning, see how much I get. And I will show you guys in the morning. Mom, mm -hmm. really? I'm named the baby Michael. <laughs> no, his name is Jeremiah. All right, y'all, so it is the next day, and I just finished pumping. <clears throat> I got two ounces out of my left breast, and I got 
four ounces out of my right breast. So this makes me really happy. This is uh, the amount that I normally get, right around the amount that I normally get when I pump. Um, so that lets me know that the pump is good. Um, it's gonna, it is gonna work out for me. What's your bad though? You don't want me to talk to nobody but you. You hungry? <laughs> okay, so yeah, this lets me know that the pump is going to work out for me. And I really do enjoy it. I really do like it. I was able to do other things while I was pumping. Um, I was kind of still kind of nervous because I was like, is it going to is it gonna give me all, my, all of my milk that I normally get? Um, but it did. And so I'm happy about that. Um, I, so I washed the pieces yesterday, put it all together, and it was very easy to assemble. It was very easy to disassemble and wash. Um, so, so far, so good. I'm really loving it. And yeah, got me a new breast pump and I am able to do other things while I pump. So y'all, praise God. <laughs> all right, y'all. Thank y'all for watching this video. I hope y'all enjoyed it. And if you did, please hit the like button. And if you are new to our channel, please subscribe and also turn on the post notification bell so that you are notified every time we post a new video. All right, y'all. See y'all in the next video.